Hello everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play Cyberpunk 2077 with the Phantom Liberty DLC. I'm your host, Colors Fade. It's episode 60. We're in Dogtown. We have to call Mr. Hands to do some things here. Mr. Hands. Hands, need a favor. Straight to biz. I like it. Aiming to go to an upcoming shindig at the Black Sapphire. Lusting to dance with the devil. V, the place is inaccessible and treacherous in equal parts. You cannot simply walk in uninvited as opposed to, say, Conpecky Plaza. Surely there's some way in. Hmm. I'll need to twist an arm or a leg. Thanks to you, I have a veritable buffet of limbs to choose from. So, doable, you think? You helped to solidify my position in Dogtown. I'm happy to return the favor. We'll conclude this in person. I'll need some hours. Meet me at the Heavy Hearts. Thanks, Hens. So if you haven't done three missions for Mr. Hands, you have to go do them at this point. Let's see. You know what? I miss my caliber, actually. She is a badass car. Not quite put together for, uh, not quite appropriate for Dogtown, but what the hell? All right, so Mr. Hands says we gotta wait for a couple hours. What kind of trouble can we get into in Dogtown? There is Mr. Hands, completed gigs. Continue your journey through Dogtown to unlock new gigs. There's a gig over here. Let's go see about that. Oh, and let's level up our character. Put another point in the reflexes. Over here in the intelligence side of things, we can put another point in here and get our Q size up to level three now, and then we'll be able to get it to four right there. So working our way up that side, make our quick hacks all the more potent. Oh, the Rayfield. It's Dogtown on a very scenic night. And you might think that, that that looks amazing. That's really cool, that building and all its LED awesomeness. But there is a globe down in Vegas now that can do that, and it's pretty freaking amazing. So, science fiction always is just very close to becoming reality. I'll deal with you later, buddy. Maybe you can be helped. Maybe you can... Oh, crud. What the hell? Oh, that guy just took a dirt nap. Get out, you little bitch! You better run. There's some guys back here that want to shoot me. They decided to have a gunfire fight. Who's the person who wants to kill me? This turkey? Yeah. That's how we do things around here. I heard those guns and I'm like, what's going on? And it's a car chase. It's actually a bike chase. But I didn't want to be involved in that. There's the bike on the road. That's hilarious. There's the car. Transferring funds. What did I get that money for? Animal Defenders Associated. Dear Mr. V. What? Thank you once again for your timely assistance in rescuing the American short hair you recently encountered. Delighted to inform you that Dear Mittens has made her way back to the Washington safe and sound and is now in a caring, loving home. Oh God, this is funny. This is about the president. The transfer also includes a small bonus for your diligent attempt at helping us locate the elusive Violet Rose Finch. 
<laughs> the, the violet rose fitch. We will do everything we can to protect this beautiful endangered songbird. Yeah. We hope that this has only been the beginning of our long lasting mutual partnership. Let's fight for a better future for all animals. The American Animal Defenders Association. Another one rescued. The president got back safe. And and they're letting us know about something. That's hilarious. Coded message. That is killing me. I'm loving it. Awesome. What's over here? It's on the outside? What's this gig out here? Oh, man. I don't know if I actually want to go through here. Uh, we have to exit Dogtown. This is only a slight pain in the butt here. It's like the Panama locks. The Panama Canal. What they're looking for here, I don't know. Yo! Skedaddle, I'm trying to skedaddle. There's something going on over here. What is this bit of biz over here? Pacifica. Two hops held prisoner in their old station turned drug drop. Absurd, yes, but what can I say? You won't leave our boys in blue hanging, will you? Oh. What do you got for me? Stella? Something the matter? Get down. Can't get spotted by Dodger's men. Wouldn't it be easier to just move the car? Folding the seats might not cut it. Listen, this is serious, okay? You don't mess with Dodger's people. Okay, <laughs> sure. Need your help with my fiance, Bill, and his buddy, Charlie. They're trapped in the building across the street. Hans mentioned they're both NCPD. Both grade A gonks, too. Sometimes do side gigs around town. Wanted to cut a deal with Dodger, but things obviously went south. Bill called me from inside, said only that, and I quote, it's bad. And if I don't get help, Dodger will paint the walls with their brains. This is Claire's voice, the voice actress who did Claire in the original part of Cyberpunk, the whole car race girl. She's the bartender at the afterlife. I really like her voice. It's great to see her do a different role. Okay, so tell me more about Charlie and your fiance. So Bill's your fiance. Charlie's his partner. What else can you tell me about him? Bill. Bill's a good guy, but Charlie? He's like the big older brother that gets you into all kinds of shit. Okay, so we don't like Charlie. Look, Night City's turned all of us into who we are, but Charlie? He's a fucking magnet for trouble. Always has been. Mm, okay. So you, Bill, and Charlie are all badges with a whole precinct full of badge tombs at your back, but instead you call a merc. Dodger's not exactly a legit businessman. Can't call dispatch for this. They'll crucify us. Okay. It's bad. Nothing else. It's really bad, Stella. Please get help. I love you. <laughs> Sweet of him, but not really what I was after. When I asked what happened, he said it was too complicated for a quick hollow. Why's Dodger got you all shaking at the knees? He's a dealer with close ties to Hanson. Total psycho, too. Moved to Dogtown to avoid serious prison time. Just please try not to wipe Dodger's men. You'll make things go from bad to worse. Take this access card. Dodger took over an abandoned NCPD precinct. Security systems are still up and running, so this should get you in without a hitch. Upsides of last-gen NCPD tech, huh? 
Save them. Please. Well, we'll certainly give it a try. I mean... Okay. So I got Hanson's guys there. I've got a stairway up here. I got gunshots in the distance. Well... Do I have the best cyberware that I want for this? I certainly want that and contagion and that and that. Reboot optics, yeah. Bait is the only one that might not do me any good. But it's suicide is 24. I'm not so worried about that. I might want that silent one. Let's get rid of bait. Where's the one that silently kills them? Memory wipe. Prevents the target enemy from noticing you for a short time. 1.5 seconds, that's not long. <laughs> Yeah, what I'm looking for here is System Collapse knocks out an enemy without making noise by crippling their nervous system. Minus 12 RAM costs for a short time after reducing trace progress. Stacks two times. Minus 12 RAM costs for a short time after reducing trace progress. So I wonder if that means that I could like knock out another enemy to reduce trace progress and then use this for... For 26, I mean for 16 instead of 12. If it stacked two times, you could get it down to, what, the cost of four? Let's try that. Let's see how that works. Let's see if our math is right or if we just flat out don't understand how it operates. So I got Choom over there, Choom down there. Hanson's guys. Where's the other guy? Right here. Okay. If I do this, I go reboot optics on him. Now I've done that. Now can I do system collapse for how much? For 16, it does work like that. Oh, that's awesome. Anybody else? We can't force that open. Got nothing here. In this side of the building. Okay. That's interesting. Well, I just really wanted to know if it worked the way that I thought the math worked. And guess what? It does. So... What you want to do? He's got an orange part here. That's nice. Okay. What do we got? Gonna kill anybody in time? Optics on that guy. Come out! Let's end this. Burst. System collapse for four. Oh. Ah. Oh. Messages. Scav shard. Yo, scored a supposedly uncrackable shard from the scavs. Oops. More, more, keep shooting. Ah. Let's do you with a reboot optics. Oh, fucking come out, man.
Time now! Okay. The sponsor for the festival is the Arasaka Corporation. And in an exciting development, even Panaka Arasaka has announced her company. Well, what else we got going on? What is the OA notification system? Hmm, not sure what all of that is about. I don't want that guy's gun. No, no, I don't want his gun. No, 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 no. Where's my burrier? Right there. I don't want that gun. Find Bill and Charles. Well, we'll do that, but first. Talk to the Headless Wonder over here. Let's see about this. What do we got in the system? Yo, scored a supposedly uncrackable shard from the scavs. Want to take a shot at it? It belonged to some Zeta Tech corporal. His name's Hassan or some shit. Pick what's on there, Chum. Pacifica Precinct Restructuring. NCPD Pacifica Precinct is hereby disbanded in the contracts of all officers working there and are terminated. We suggest you leave the precinct in civilian attire in view of strong anti-police sentiments in the area. We have also received reports of planned riots in Pacifica, including a potential attack on the precinct itself, which is why we advise you to leave the building ASAP. The decision to disband the precinct has been fully backed by Mary Lucia Shrine. Here's the deal. You need to find the dumb fuck who swiped my powder. Dumb fuck's name is Jesse Turner. Some of you may remember him as one of our runners back in the day. I took off to NC with my white girl, but ask your city chooms if they seen him round. Whoever finds the rash boy will be rewarded. Okay, well. That's neither here nor there. Okay. Oh, it looks like I got something here. And open that up but first take that and we do have what down here that's yeah we, we've been in here okay what are we gonna get for this little piece Alright, so this, one C right there, one C down here, one C over here, if we go 55, 55, FF, 55, it's just those two. That's the, oh, so that ladder would have led right up into here. Oh, I hit the wrong button. Didn't mean to go into overclock mode, that's alright. We'll live. Bill and Charles, where are you two bozos? This association recently came to a close. One of the hottest topics discussed was the ever-increasing rate of cyber psycho attacks. Over the last decade, What do we have here? We have this. Company expense account shard. Oh, we can crack the security on this bad boy. Okay, so this is just a... 1C, 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 oh, so it's a 1C, BD, 1C, 1C, BD, 1C, 1C. Funds transferred, cautions, data tech company expense account funds may only be used for purchases of legal goods. 
buying and selling products from illicit sources will be subject to severe punishment. Well, come get me, Zeta Tech. Visitors from NC fucking PD. <laughs> okay, two badges came by in their squad car. And who'd they bring? The Jesse Turner fuck who stole all our merch. No shit. And they say the NCP did, uh, NCPD does fuck all for the citizens. They're waiting for you down in the basement. The popo and the perp. Guess they're gonna get that finder's fee. Told them you'll come in sometime during the day. They said they have time and can wait for you, so they waiting. Um, okay. So those are two. Oh, are we heavy? We must be heavy. We are. Well, let's go get rid of some stuff here. Let's take some of these higher level things and get higher level parts out of them. Like this. That's a smart assault rifle. I want to hang on to that. Tech sniper can go. Our shotgun can go. Our pistol can go. Other power pistol can go. And another power pistol can go. And a smart double barrel shotgun can go. We got the better version of that, so we can get rid of that. And that. And that. And this thing, power pistol for orange parts, we'll take it. Okay. Alright, let's see. Whoa, what's this? Shotgun. Oh my god, look at this. Holy crap. There's a bunch of weapons over here. There's a basement. And that's where we will go. For Christ's sake, there's a switch to the right. Use it. My right or your right? My fucking right. Huh? Someone there? Hello? Who's asking, Charlie or Bill? It's Charlie. So Stella did manage to find someone. Thank fuck. Okay, let's try to get this open. Fucking slab this thing. Little help. Hmm, okay. Well Come on. Jesus fucking Christ. I know. What the fuck? Don't worry. Not my blood. <laughs> the hell happened? Uh, better see for yourself. It's just through here. Just through here. That's never good. What the f This is Bill. Hi. Oh, uh, yeah. Who's your friend? Uh, who, me? Just told you, I I'm Bill. Thanks, Bill. Got that. No, I mean the dead fucking body on the table you somehow failed to mention to Stella. We, we didn't kill him, okay? We, we, we swear. Let's see. Two blood-soaked dudes locked in a room with a gutted corpse. Yeah, real puzzler. <laughs> Better take ages for a detective to unravel this one. <laughs> Go on. Tell him about your genius idea. My idea? You're the one who Plan set up the deal with was Dodger. was rock fucking solid. If only you didn't leave a bag of drugs in front of a junkie. How was I supposed to know he'd swallow it? Whoa. You say drugs? Oh, you go. No, you. I swear to fucking God. Ladies. Went like this. Choom over here clips Dodger's shit. Hightails it to NC. We catch wind, Dodgers put out a bounty to bag him. Bring back his nose candy. Bump right into him during a routine stop. Dumb fucking luck. Oh, wow. Choom was carrying seven ounces of Sin Coke. So we cuffed him. Took him here. Choom swallowed seven whole ounces? That, that even possible? So we're here, waiting on Dodger, when Bill pops the baggie on the table like it's nothing. All of a sudden, this gonk turd yells, fuck you, pigs, and stuffs the bag in his mouth. Could have had a food tube implant, like a deep, wide throat. Yeah, like the one your mom's got. <laughs> fuck you even talking about, Bill. Why would he do that? Makes no sense. 
Fuck if I know. It's not like he made a list of pros and cons. Bag must have broke because he got all foamy at the mouth. Started spazzing out and then just croaked. That's when we started to panic. This fool gulped tens of thousands worth of eddies. What the fuck else are we supposed to do? Hmm. If the bag already broke, why bother trying to play operation? We panicked, all right? Shit happens. This... It's all gone. Dissolved. And now Dodger's gonna end us. So you bring him the thief who swiped his dope. Only now there's no thief. Or dope. <laughs> yeah. It's about the gist of it. You gotta help us get out of here. All right. Let's get moving. Oh, I like One this. One last tiny this thing. This is great. Came here in our squad car and, uh, kinda need it back. Just keeps getting better. Where is it? In the garage. To the garage we it's go. It's official, V. Finally made it to the major league. No shit. League of first class leadheads, to be precise. I'm in agreement with nice you, Johnny. Nice you to join us, Johnny. Still Always gonna value. kill me if he finds out what we did. I'm a dead man walking. Probably. You know what you could use? What? A nice big pair of balls. Oh, cause you're such a tough guy? Not like you stutter in front of the cap every fucking time. I don't fucking stutter. Let us through here before. What was the code again? 2893? It was 2983. Idiot, it was 2893. Saw him punch it. Go on. Didn't these, work. These two are ah, going to end up there. 2983, I fucking told you. Dodger school. Careful. Whatever you say, Chum. But since we're here, I gotta get paid. I think I have the easiest one here. It's gonna be 1C, 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 55. And then you can go to 1C, BD, E9, and an FF, because there's only two E9s on the whole thing. So that made for a little bit of a difficulty. Again? Come on, guys. Hey, this wasn't us, okay? A switch around here somewhere. Dodger will drown us in eddies, Bill. The plan is foolproof, Bill. Trust me, I know what I'm saying, Bill. <sighs> Shut Blaming up. Blaming Moss. So when I imagine what the net was like before Bart Moss, I could see thousands of potential threats and thousands of opportunities. Of course, the whole system was unstable. Corporal runners pulling one way, post-war rogue AIs pulling the other. Financial markets tanked, virus mutations spiraled in uncontrollable ways, and runners got cooked in their living rooms every now and then. Bart Moss saw the net as a grenade waiting for the pin to get pulled, and that's exactly what he did. Fuck it, right? Let the world burn. Bart Moss fucked the system, but fucked all of us right along with it. Just look at it now. Corpse are on top as usual. The black wall, which was supposed to protect us after the next crash, is just another control tool in Netwatch's arsenal. Before Bart Moss, the net was an untamed jungle. If you could navigate it, you had a chance to survive. You were free. After Bart Moss, the net's like an airport security check. Every step you take, Netwatch is checking your papers and performing a thorough cavity search. Oh, but all for your own good, of course. What if it's fucking Pacifica? What, too pussy to set foot there, Bill? Afraid of earning some serious scratch? Says the asshole who couldn't keep a bag in his fucking pocket. Garage door is busted. Something short circuits when you power it up. Mark claims it's the wiring, but who the fuck knows what the problem really is. So you gotta rewire it every time. Otherwise the fuse blows and the entire building goes dark. Oh, great. Rewire it every time. I gotta go back there. Okay. Right here? Is this where we're looking at, friends? Yeah. Gotcha. 
Don't you guys die on me before I get over there. You guys are so dead. You're not getting out of here, are you? Hey. Oh, shit, shit, shit. Go check it out. You got it. What's going on? They're coming. I know. Do something. Show yourself! system claps because now <laughs> it only costs four. <laughs> oh, I love it. It only costs four. Oh my God. That's awesome. That is awesome. Oh my gosh. I love how that really expensive thing becomes really cheap. If you do it that way. Oh my god, I love that. That is incredibly awesome. Oh, they have done some really cool things with this game. Really cool. Get rid of all this power stuff. Power. X sniper rifle. Power submachine gun. Power shotgun. Power assault rifle. Tech sniper rifle. I don't need the Nekomata or the power shotgun. Barrel shotgun, power shotgun, power double barrel shotgun. Okay. Smart submachine gun. And get rid of a lot of this stuff into component parts. I do need to probably be selling more of it. I love that though. That's incredible. I mean, four to get that guy so we get him at range. Don't have to sneak up on him. That's just badass. Our squad cars right through here. Yeah, tell me about it. You, you guys do are gonna have get them, don't you? Gun down right here, Shit. aren't you? Wait, don't tell me you left them upstairs. Kill Chum. Got him right here. Okay. Roger. Oh fuck. Okay. Would you look at that? A welcome. And I can't just put now a target not hackable. How thoughtful. Greetings, fellas. Oh, I'm out early. We uh, we can explain. Quiet. You I don't know. Care to introduce yourself? Yeah, okay. Got hired by these two to help. Oh, <laughs> they look like they could use a hand, alright. One thing I can't put my finger on, though. What's that you got on your faces? A little ketchup? Run out of napkins? Uh... Yeah, well... Uh, no, not us. Per se. You any better at speaking full sentence? Um... Uh, there was a shootout. A, a, a guy got hit. It was, it was bleeding out fast. After that, brought your stuff here. Uh, left it all upstairs, so... It's all good. Another smooth talker. All right. Third time's a charm. Is he spinning yarns? Done playing games. Mind if we skip to the part where we try to zero each other? Thought you'd never ask. Eesh. Here we go. Let's do... Oh, I want Synapse for now. Dang it. 
Cyberware malfunction, overheat, more cyberware malfunction. Oh. Safe to come out. Dodger ain't breathing. Is it over? Yup. Nothing left but hop in your ride, flee the scene. Sure you can manage that much. Thanks. So we going or what? Yeah, yeah. Hey, thanks again. Okay. I'll radio us in. Tell him we're back. Wait. I'll get Stella on the auto first. <laughs> Scoot yourself. Baby. You two losers aren't going to make it as cops for very long, man. V, so tell me, what did our boys in blue do this time? Just everything. Swear to Christ, if someone asks me one more time... Prickly today, are we? I'll make do without details. If the client is happy, then so am I. Contract closed. Clowns. I love that quest. That was great. A couple of bumbling cops. Oh my gosh, that whole thing was fun. Alex tried leveraging some contacts, all busts. One officer willing to open a back door for us suddenly went dark. Probably choking on dirt or salt water by now. I've got one of my own who could give us an inside chance, outside chance, but that son of a bitch is best at what he does, not wanting to be found. Chill. I'll find us something. What's that old expression? This ain't my first trespass of Max Security Hotel. I got you covered, Reed. We're just waiting for Mr. Hand, so let's go get into some trouble. Where are you at, car? It ain't Roach the horse. Area hostile. From who? From what? Well, what kind of trouble can we get into and where can we get into trouble at? Let's say there's Biz right there and there's Biz there. Find Aaron. Oh yeah, that's the, that's the guy who's doing the uh, boxing, which I don't care about. Filter jobs. There's a job here for Mr. Hands. There's a job up here. There's, oh, there's a cyber psycho. Oh. Yeah. I want to do some cyber psychoing. Let's leave Pacifica for a little bit since we got to wait for Hands to contact us. On a beautiful night, city night. On the wrong side of the road. But what do we care? Let's go kill a cyber psycho. Oh my god. You gotta love how the All Foods poster looks like something out of They Live. Like, I'm pretty sure that was intentional. The streets are clear for me? For once? Are you joking? Must be like 3 in the morning then. Space. Let's go find out what this is about. Why is it telling me the area is also hearts, hearts? The building is a large imitation pyramid. I dare say you can't miss it. You'll need the elevator access code as well. Twenty-five eighty-nine. It'd be hard. 
New job, cyber psycho sighting. V, a few Zeta Tech corporals walked into an auto shop. The punchline, none came back out. Apparently it's a family business that's fallen on hard times. My hunch is... Yeah. The owners finally snapped, and you know I got a nose for this stuff. I know you do. I'll take care of it, darling. Get me up there. Where is our actual cyber psycho? Nope. Not today. I got a camera. And there's this guy. And where's our actual cyber psycho? Okay. It can't be this guy. Oh, he got back up from that. That's him though? So what if we do... I'm gonna do this. I need my all my RAM back here. Or as much of it as I can get as possible. Alright, buddy. Here we go. We're gonna do... Hmm. We got a bunch of stuff here. Cyberware malfunction. That and another cyberware malfunction behind it. 42,000 for the critical hit. Yep, I got you. That was fun. Unresponsive, no pulse. There are tons of explosives around here. Lots of them, man. What do you got for me here, buddy? An Ajax, a power assault rifle, and you. Stop, don't do it. Let this be a warning to anyone thinking about buying this shop. Don't be fooled by the fantastic location or top shelf equipment. Because guess what? None of it will be yours, even after you sign whatever agreement the corp gives you. What, you surprised? Well, so was I. I shouldn't have been, though. It was right there in front of my eyes in black and white. I didn't want to waste my time reading some complicated agreement with more twists than that Apple novel by a certain Virginia. I also didn't bother doing my research or else I would have found out the shop changed hands three times already this year and the previous owners disappeared without a trace. Except their debts, that is. All I can say is, I've dealt with my fair share of gangs looking for protection, money, or a one-time heist. But nobody, and I mean nobody, has ever fucked me over quite like the suits at Zeta Tech. So I've got only one answer for them. A wrench to the face and a vice for their fingers. Oh, I'm sorry, dude. I'm sorry it went down like that for you. Now what I need to do search the area to collect information. There's this. You.
What's on the old laptop? Messages. Penis nanogel scam alert. Need someone to watch your back? License. What license? Hey, I got a cease and desist from Zeta Tech. They say I'm using that lift in my shop without a license. What is this? I bought the whole shop from them. Spent my life savings on it. They want to get me again because of some license? Could you check and see if they made a mistake somewhere and what sort of eddies are we talking about here? Yeah. Hmm. Regina, this guy got hosed by the system. That's what happened. He got hosed. Auto shop owner is on a rampage, but I managed to put him to sleep. The way corpse were gobbling up small businesses, it's almost painful to watch. Before they even clock what's happening, the owners are locked out of their own premises and slapped with a colossal debt. And then they bust their asses for the corp from morning to midnight to make ends meet. Looks like this one preferred to take his own life than give up the one place that was his. See how quickly the American dream can turn into the American nightmare? Yeah, it's indentured servitude, and by the way, that's where we're all headed. If we don't, uh, union up, baby. Ping. Just curious if there's anything here that I can grab. You can disarm. Bye bye. This thing though. Can you do, can I do anything with you? Oh, that sucked. Car exploded. All right. Well, that's done. Oh, and the city has come to life. The Manticore. I'm going to try not to get run over on the way back to my car. Well, that's one cyber cycle down. That was a pretty big hit, though. What's this gig? Take off right out in front of you. Look at that road. Oh my god. The water reflection and everything. This is this is maddening how awesome this is. When it comes to what games can look like, Cyberpunk has set the new standard, that's for sure. Alright, what do we have here? Let's just park right here, shall we? Gig on a tight leash. V, this time I needed to restore the natural balance in this city. A Valentino dropped a cop and has gone unpunished. You can change that. If you find out who's covering for the gang, then I'll pay extra. Spect attached. Okay, so there's this guy way up there, but there's more people than that. This big wall here. That thing. I gotta get rid of that right away. Right now. Turn it off. I want to get up there and start with that guy on the roof, though. But this whole thing did not go the way I was hoping. Okay. I'm just gonna ping first. I wanna see who's where. Okay. I am going to do a reboot optics on her. Yo, we put on the links we got yet. Uh-huh. Yeah. Now that person is down, and there's a ladder here. Get rid of that. 
Where is this heavy handed dude? Are there two people talking or is it just her? Pendejo. ¿Qué pinche jueguito es este? Al carajo, órale. Okay. That helps. Now I can do some system reset on some people if I need to. Let's see, who do I want to do it to? System collapse is four for that person. Let's do it on her because she looks like she's tough. That guy took off, didn't he? He was like, oh, I'm not getting caught with this. He like cyber cybered his way right out of there. Let's go to cyberware malfunction. Facing my location, I gotta... Let's do a short circuit on you. He's down. It's this one. Cyberware malfunction overheat. That person's done. Who else is left? Now who do we got? What's it like being a coward, huh? Well, it works out pretty good for me. Insufficient RAM. I almost have overclock ready. That's just a... Okay, here we go. Overclock. Let's do... Let's do... Do I want to contagion these guys? Not system collapse. Synapse burnout. No, no, that's not what I want. Not system collapse either. What am I... Cyberware malfunction. Go that contagion. You're dying, honey. Where? Who thinks they got me? Who thinks they got a hold of me? Under the building. Oh, it's a bathroom. There's gotta be someone in this corner, right? Where are these guys? 
Two of them, I think we're in the basement. But now I think I got a guy outside. Well, I'm still like a level up. Where is he? They gotta be down one level. Okay, is he out here? Is he outside? He's downstairs. He's over the edge here. Okay. Down in there somewhere. Here he is, right there. It's gonna cost five for a system collapse of you. <laughs> oh, Toom. Bummer for you. Optical camel thing, it's so cool. God grant me the patience to track down that bastardo. I am really digging the whole stealth playthrough. That is just... That is really cool. Especially the mechanic... Especially the mechanic that's gonna let me nail this guy for a whopping five on... Si four on system collapse. Down he goes. And then when we need to, we've got powerful handgun headshots, so... I'm just thrilled with this. This is incredible. Where are... Oh, you outside? You wanna play too? I got just a thing for you. We got this bad boy. Where is she? Oh, there you are. Right there. Guess what? I got something for you, too. Let's go. We can hit you with synapse for now. Oh, in that case, what's it cost for cyber malfunction, synapse burnout? Ow. Okay. Well, let's go in here and find this. This guy dropped some fat piece of orange gear. A baseball bat. Got her out here. We got a little weird texture thing going on with the ground there. That's a little outside the realm of what we'd like. Emperor Ragnar. What? Huh. Can this? you spot the two things that don't match? I give up. Hint one, Militech. Hint two, Valentinos. Johnny. Militech. Hmm, okay. The Warsaw Catholic Faith, no. Militech vehicles. Hmm. Alright, what else can I find out in here? What's it got to say in here? Got a couple of rolls. What do we have here? Messages. Gonzalo Rivero's funeral. Our friend of many years fell in battle during a shootout with the NC pigs. Gonzalo Rivero. He was like a brother to us. If you want to pay your respects, not like it's a fucking choice, go to the La Catrina funeral home. Praise be to San Muerte, and remember, she gives life as she takes life. Save my life. Greetings, my name is Gansuk. Uh, unpronounceable, and I am Mongol Techno Shaman. Okay, well, 
That's not what I'm looking for. Who would have thought? Well, well, oh, either but... they're planning a costume party, or they're gearing up for a different sort of party. I'm yeah. intrigued in either case. Militech gear. Hmm, okay, and what do we have around here? Sonic Shock Distract. What is this? Cyberdeck? Militech hmm. ammo. Militech ammo. Each shell's like a signature, leaving behind a trail. A trail back to Militech. Boom. Dead, and all eyes are on the corp, at least for a little while. What else is in here? Anything else? There's the bathroom. Do we have anything else that helps explain what's going on here? Archive conversation. Can't right now. What's up? That caregiver never showed up. I'm here alone. Ese pinche puta. I'll send one of the boys to help you. No. I need you. I can't, abuelo. I have to stay put. Please, just come. I can't even stand up. And I had an accident. I don't want them to see. I really can't. I'll send someone you can trust. Don't worry, it happens. Fuck this. No. And stop saying shit like that to every single caregiver. Maybe then we won't have this problem. Oh, really? What's on here? Last warning, Jose. Our patience has its limits. We paid your bail because we already invested in you and investments need returns. But you're not untouchable. You fuck up again and you get in another gonk shootout instead of our help, you'll get a rope around your neck. Remember, Arasaka pays for solving problems and punishes for creating new ones. Oh, and stay close to the holo. We'll call you soon and tell you exactly how you're going to attack our facility. Remember that people need to die and that you have to use the Militech equipment we give you. To the media, it has to look like a Militech squad attacked an Arasaka facility. That's all. Mm -hmm. Well now, we have the complete picture. Adios, everyone. Well, Corpo's playing Corpo games. Oh, and there's big fat orange things over here. What is this? The Zuo smart shotgun. Oh, and a bunch of ammo. And what was that? That was a big, like, orange gun. Was that a super smart? Can I get? can't get uh they don't have by latest which is the sad they should just have that by default so this right here that's what i want smart assault rifle side runner that's what we picked up nice magazine capacity what else can we put in there recoil larger smart targeting reticle 25 27.5 bullet velocity fit 13.5 armor penetration effective range bullet spread from hip fire Magazine capacity. Drawing the weapon automatically refills its ammo up to 25%. Mm, that doesn't seem useful. Damage, 12% damage against enemies. Mm. Against skull enemies. Magazine capacity and reload speed. I really want the smarter target reticule. That's, we'll have to work on some of that. And we can level up. We get a new hurt shard. Okay, so we want this. This gives us another quick hat Q thing. And plus 15 damage against enemies with a locked Q. Oh. Excellent. Well, let's grab the last few things that are laying around here and then get out of here. Oh, there's a person under there, but. We'd have to move this car. 
that's what we'll do. Padre? Nice working for you once again. It's V. Took care of Jose. Nice work. Really, really nice work. Did you learn who busted him out after he killed that batch? Arasaka. Arasaka. <laughs> You're telling me a mega corp was involved in the killing of some ordinary beat cop? Joffrey's death was an accident. Jose was covered for another reason. I'm still listening. He and his crew were hired to launch a full-blown assault on an Arasaka facility, and to do it using Militech equipment. Attacking Arasaka. On Arasaka's behalf. Shit. You need to get out of there. Seeing as I'm already here, I could stick around, try to find out more. Won't find nothing you don't already know. Location's already blown. You know more than you're telling. Spill. I'm just speculating here, but... Out with it. There's a good chance that Arasaka's looking to pick a serious fight with Militech. Maybe even all-out war. And? Jose's hit was meant to be their excuse? Kinda slim, don't you think? It's not just Jose. I've heard of other cases. Same M.O. This runs deep, V. And Militech. They must have noticed Arasaka's moves. Likely. But Militech doesn't want more. They will delay, prepare, and prepare some more. That info's worth a healthy heap in some circles. Not this time, no. Not my board. Not my game. See you around, V. Yeah, be seeing you. And that wraps up that. Well, I found my friendly ghost, Reed says. And we have to go to collect our reward, okay. Your bonus is ready to collect. Let's go get that and then we'll end the episode. Reed's ghosts end up not being of any value at all. What that message meant. It's up to us. Of course it is. There's our bonus over there. Okay. Well, we can keep ourselves from getting run over. Let's go get it. Who knows if we'll run into any... Oh, look. Thugs here. It's a crazy game. It looks amazing, as always. As always. Oh, and we ha we are back up to over 100k. Very nice. Well, there it is. Gig done, folks. Cyberpunk. I'm blown away. I'm having so much fun with this DLC and so much fun with the 2.0 revamp and so much fun with the character build. This is a blast, so everybody enjoy, as always, if you dig it, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, leave your questions and comments down below, and I'll see you next time. Until then, happy gaming, everyone.